Hey, what's up guys? ALJB Gaming here, and I wanted to show you guys some Neverwinter gameplay. I really thought this area was cool, so I was like, you know what, I'm just going to make a video on uh, me playing in this area. So, let us continue having a lot of fun with there the Neverwinters. One of the best things, I think, in the world is probably this pixie dust trail that I follow that tells me where to go. So I don't even have to think about what I'm doing. I can just follow it, and it takes me everywhere I go. And also, it's a pretty intelligent line because... Um, even if you have multiple quests going, it will show. It will um, switch between the quests if there is a like a something you can do that's closer than the quest you're on. So you can say like you're running to a quest area, but all of a sudden there is something. Some other guy you got to talk to for a different quest line. It'll bop you over there, and then go back to the original one or whatever next quest is closer to your area that you're at and continue on with that. So it actually has some intelligence to it. It's not just whatever quest you're pointing towards, whatever quest you selected up here. It actually, uh, the closest possible action on a quest, it points to, or it goes to. Very, very cool. I think more games need that. I find myself lost in a lot of MMOs because I'm unfamiliar with it. And this is awesome. <laughs> that is so awesome. Alright, and my little eyes disappeared. Where do I go? Kill cult of mercenaries. I'm not really following the storyline. I probably should. I kind of want to, but I haven't been. Definitely enjoying it though. Hopefully I get to 60. Um, I, I've downloaded so many games because of all the sales on Steam that I uh, tend to get a bit distracted. Oh, I see what's going on. There's an area it pointed me towards. So there's mercenaries in this area. Yeah, there's so many sales on Steam. I just got Borderlands 2 for $13. I still haven't finished Far Cry 3 playthrough. I haven't finished Darksiders 2 playthrough. Not even close. I really want to. Dark Souls probably is not going to happen. It's, uh, this is too hard to put into like a Let's Play. I could do focuses of boss fights or something. But, you know, you die so much, it's like, do people really want to watch this? Yeah, there's so many good deals in the Steam store. And after I got this computer, it's like, I have to buy it. There's so many games I've been seeing. When all I had was a crappy little laptop, I could play like Dota. Um, barely could play Path of Exile. And uh, I saw so many games coming and going that I just was dying to play and wasn't able to. And now I got this new computer. And every time I see a sale on a game I wanted to play, I buy it pretty much instantly. I got The Witcher, Witcher 2 for like $7. Uh, Battlefield 3 for like 12 uh, Borderlands 2 for 13. I just bought Skyrim too. Uh, Far Cry was like 30, I think. L.A. Noir for like seven. Just crazy, 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 che crazy cheap prices. I cannot pass those up. It's too good. Too good to pass. Erp. All right, some stuff there. Need to find some more mercenaries. I've not found another one. Where are you? You probably just killed one. Hey, buddy. I need to cast my shield, bruh. Whoa, holy damage. Level 28, okay. I think I got my companion Jon Snow with me, tanking it up like a bounce. See if I can. Oh my! So I have two mercenaries here. What up? Let us do some a stuff. 18 minutes. I remember 18 hours. Oh. Um. Let's do mercenary. Hmm. Five percent speed. That's it. No thanks. Hours. Let's 
do that again. I'm just doing this uh, for the leadership because I want to uh, level it up because at the end here um, there is some pretty cool stuff that you can uh, get from doing this. Continue leveling your, leveling your leadership. Um, also, I want to be doing this as well. Um, getting speed boosts for the uh, crafting time. There's a bunch of different ways to do it. You can uh, craft a new type of mercenaries for the leadership role, for the leadership um, category of crafting. Adventurer plus 25% speed. Um, hero plus 50% speed, but it takes 18, 18 hours. Okay, so if I can get an army of these guys, which is going to take quite a long time, I can craft like a crazy, so that will be most excellent. And I'll try to do that. Most excellent. A lot of runestones come up. A lot of combining runestones. The runestones. Look at these fools. Look at these fools. I need my shield. Grrrr. Really wish I had more time to play these, man. Uh, I work quite a bit. Wish this was my job. <laughs> That'd be awesome. That'd be amazing. Oh my gosh. If I can make money doing this. Wow. On the internet. Okay, I might be going outside my circle. Yeah. Mercenaries are a bit scarce. Usually they pop up a little easier. Minion. Ah, oh, there he is again. Key. Nope. Oh. You go away. Here. Freeze, mother effer. almost have five gold. At five gold, I can buy my own horse. I am renting one now. The quest line I'll, uh, rents you one for free, but it disappears after a while. But they give you plenty enough time to accumulate five gold. So, that's pretty fair there, I think. These fools. Definitely enjoying the Neverwinter. Um, I mean, if you haven't tried it, download it. It's free. Um, there's a big... The biggest complaint about this game is that apparently it is pay to play on the higher end. Um, I haven't ran into that problem yet because I'm still level 26. And I'm having a great time with it. I mean, I don't see anything really slowing me down. I don't get reduced experience, it doesn't seem. Um... I don't know, it hasn't hindered me personally that much, but then again, you know, like I said, um, holy cow, uh, I'm not very far into it. Oh, these guys are not kidding around. Yay! Quest completed, now I haven't got to think about where I'm supposed to go, boom, it just takes me to where I'm supposed to go, that's awesome. Don't even have to look. What a great feature. Seriously, this is like game-breaking shit right here. All other games need this. Seriously. No, oh, mercenaries I don't want to run into. Love that skill. Okay. Uh, 
let's uh, kill zombies and hulks in uh, Pauper's Field. Dur, dur. Jump on my horsey. Oh, I'll spawn out of nowheres. <laughs> there must be better uses for an intern. Yeah, I thought this was a sweet little area. A little different than the first couple places I went to. Uh, a little more out there, a little desolate, a little darker, a little grim, kind of creepy, kind of dead stuff. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying. Let's jump on these fools. Can't even get to me. Look at these idiots just standing around like morons, acting like they can touch the control wizard of glory. But they can't. So why do they try? I don't know. Don't know. I might want to ask them. This guy looks tough-ish. Come on, Jon Snow. You're freaking slacking. He's really tough, though. I mean, I don't even have that much stuff on him. He's leveled, I guess, a little bit. Uh, not that much, but he takes some damage. I suggest getting uh, whatever he is. Jon Snow. Jon Snow, you are warrior. Uh, bleh, I don't even know what he's called. Whatever. But uh, yeah, this warrior type guy. He's a tank. It'll show in the description once uh, your companion unlock your your companion unlocks. I'll show you. I'll tell you all about it. Gear's coming along pretty good. I mean, it, does, it seems pretty... The game gives you quite a bit of gear. I don't um, feel any lack of improving in gear quite consistently. And it, it levels pretty well with the difficulty. Quite consistently, I get gear, and, you know, enemies get harder. I level up, gear gets better. Seems to be pretty well matched in that respect. I think I wasn't too sure on is what stats I really want to favor. At first I thought crit, but then I watched a video that Kerperian made. He's a YouTuber. Um, and apparently one of the better stats. He did all the he did all the Excel spreadsheet. He did the, he ran all the stats. And apparently for the control wizard, one of the better um, stats to get is the regen, I believe. And I've been stacking crit. Come on, clicking you. But I'm not sure what's happening there. Yeah, but regen apparently. Regeneration is one of the best scaling stats. The other ones have quite um, high diminished returns. So focusing on them too much really doesn't help you out that much. It kind of hurts you because you could have other stats that would be more beneficial than the extra crit stacking all those stats and not getting much from it. So get some crit, but don't get too much. Don't waste every single, you know, single millimeter of space slot on one stat. Kind of spread it out a little bit. It'll be a little more efficient. Watch Kaparian's video if you want to get into the exact specifics. But regen was definitely one of the more popular, or not the popular, the uh, most effective um, for the amount of points you put in. The least amount of diminished returns is the regen. And I think power was the only linear, linear one, so uh, the more power you have, the more power you get. There's no uh, curve in the graph of its increased uh, benefit. Well, this is actually... I will lay them to rest. Son of a bitch. Oh! Whoa, bro. Bro to bro Kai. What's up, Houston? What's up? 
Oh no! <laughs> so, <laughs> uh, again, just following the uh, dots. It doesn't turn in my quest yet because these ones are actually closer. So apparently, my pixie dust guide thinks that I should do this beforehand, and I obey with zero thought involved, zero questioning of its decisions. Because it's worked out great that way so far. So, no reason to complain. Wish I had some more AoE spells. Um, yeah. I do have one other one, but it wasn't that strong. I didn't really feel like it was worth having out with the other one. I, well, the other ones I have are a lot stronger. But I do feel a lack of AoE at the moment. I really, I really would like another spell that is AoE. Two. Having two would be great, I think. Uh, I do have one, and it's only because it's in the uh, Spell Mastery slot, so the Icicle that I throw actually does AoE damage. A lot of AoE damage it does. It doesn't have any reduction to the targets that are hit by it. The single target is the only one that gets stunned by the Icicle. But um, every everyone around in AoE takes the same amount of damage, which is pretty good. I thought it would reduce it some. But it did. Kaboosh! As you can see there, they all took damage. Very easy. Take care of this guy, apparently. It did. And that'll be up again in a second. Boom. Dunskis. This guy is all big and retarded. Go away! <laughs> no, I just kind of wanted to kill him though. Okay. That's yeah, so why I had to kill him actually. Alright, follow the pixie dust of glory. Once my brethren takes me. Jon Snow, the Night's Watch. Jon Snow. Jon Snow. Protector of the realm. Guardians of the realm. Oh, uh, where am I going here? Hey, fool. He's a soul. Probably gonna use my ultimate here, my daily. Oh man. Yeah, let's push him back and use uh Rigdarler. Kaboom! See ya. Bye bye. Oh, poor thing. Poor, poor thing. Oh. Uh oh. -huh. Uh -huh. Alright, let's get on the horse. The horse. Damn it. Damn you. Oh my gosh! Didn't push any of those buttons. I didn't mean to. Anyway. Bridge of Destiny here. Horse of Glory.
chariot of desire. We must be eternally vigilant over the grip well done. Thank you. What up? Level up. Thumbs up. Seven up. Thumbs up. Alright, so I have one point available. <laughs> Of force, the force. Chasing the points isn't that too exciting. Is it not too exciting, really? Shield, what do I get for shield? Uh, damage 10%, push 1%. Uh, boring. Okay, presence. I don't even know what this means. Plus 30%. Plus 30%. Death is our foremost duty. So this might be a gigantic increase. I can't really... T I don't know what it's saying, though. I mean, is it adding to the 34? Damage your cultivist next by 34% of the buff value. 33, 33. So 100% with the buff value. So it goes up to 30%. If that's true, yeah. I think that is true. So I could be doing up to... I can do... Okay, an arcane stack... Um, gives me 3% damage. Arcane damage... And I can have five stacks of this 15% damage increase. So if I have 100% more, so I should be able to have 30% damage if I have five arcane stacks. So six per stack. So yes, that should be good. It's actually useful. Super duper awesome cool. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Alright, let's go <coughs> turn in this last quest and then return back to these dudes. Good work, taking care Oh, uh, more stuff. I hate gnolls. Oops. All beings should walk free. My father wasn't the best role model. Actually, my father was a Than necromancer. Sell some of this crap. Identify it. See if we got anything better. Every time I level up, I have gear to put on usually. Oh, I gotta identify these with. Come on, stupid dig. We wouldn't have these right. problems. Oh, uh, recommended. So 23 power, 23 crit. <laughs> yeah, you're. Recommended. So yeah, every time I level up, I get something good. 39 power, 39 crit strike, life steal, 40 power. I think I'm going to leave mine, actually. Crit strike, I don't really care. Because, as I said before, it is diminished returns. So I will not get that for now. E but it has... Wow. It's still recommended. Wow. No, I'm going to keep my other one, though. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Yes, 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 I am. Then let's sell all this crap I do not want. Bags a little cleaner there. Request from this guy. There's a lot of quests if you want to do more than just like the main line. Special, special pack. Oh my god. What is this? One rare profession item. Oh, sweet. One epic rare or uncommon profession. No level. So are many innocent souls who are wrongly. Cool.
The red wizards are using some of the newly exhumed skeletons. All right, guys, I'm gonna call the video there. That's some good from display of what. Actually, let's go to this field. Transporting these I don't know if I showed you this field. Gate to a very cool. old or did I? Yeah, this yeah. is the first place we we're at. We need to find out where these bone porters are going. Yep, we're in here. So, yeah, I'm gonna call it there, guys. Uh, this is Neverwinter Control Wizard. Uh, what is the name of the place I'm at? Don't even know. Craft man's rest is that the name? It's all dark and spooky when I leave this main spot. Map of Never Death. So Never Winter game. Map. Never Death. Me. ALJB Gaming. You watch. Subscribe. Like. Comment. Favorite. Tell your family. Tell your friends. Tell your pets. Scream at the top of your lungs. ALJB Gaming's got the infos of all the games. Let's plays the new up and coming what's happenings. <laughs> so uh thank you for watching guys. And if you like the content, please subscribe and I'll see you guys later.